Good morning, Jackie. Good morning. Now tell me, is this your first production with Alps? No, it's my second. I just finished the Accrington Pal, which is also set in World War One. But a bit different to Blackadder Goes Forth. A little bit. It's a bit more serious. Yes, it is. Although the endings are not that dissimilar. No, and then it gets a bit serious at the end. So uh, you, you've, you've been trained professionally, I understand. University, yeah. Yeah, and you did mostly musical theatre. Yes, mostly. So we've got to find a part for you soon that will Please. give a bit of singing and dancing involved. You don't have to sing or dance in Blackadder, do you? No, no singing or dancing. Well, I have one little peep of a song. Do you? One little peep of a song. I haven't seen that bit yet. Now, what do you think of your character, Bob? I love Bob. I think she's very ballsy for getting up and going to the war and dressing up as a boy, which, you know, could put her in a lot of trouble. But most of the cast think she actually is a boy. Most of them are a little bit... Thick. <laughs> it's only Blackadder that's realised, doesn't it? Blackadder realises. The general doesn't realise. No. no. There's some wonderful lines <laughs> about that, actually. Thinks you're a man in drag at one point. Yep. So we're all very much looking forward to seeing you as Bob. As uh, what rank is Bob? Driver, which is the same as a private. Oh, okay, private Bob. Bob. Great. Well, um, good luck and um, sell some of those tickets. Thank you. Bye.